obviously it's disappointing to lose. Um, you know, I think the first innings, um, you know, we didn't get enough runs in that. And that um, but we've got to bounce back now and um, you know, we played some good cricket in the first week, so hopefully we can bounce back this week against Essex and, and get another good result. Yeah, exactly. It hasn't been easy um, with the you know with the weather, as you say, and, and quite a few injuries. So it's been tough, but um, you know we, we fought hard in the first two games. We've got to win out of one of them against a good team. So hopefully we can bounce back now against Essex. Um, you know we've, we've got a few players back from injury, and um, you know hopefully we can put in a good, good performance. Johnny and uh, and Joe back in the squad, which I guess is really exciting for all the players. Yeah, absolutely. Um, you know, they're they quality international cricketers. Um, you know, they've done very well for England over the years, so it's great to have them around. Uh, we don't get to see them often, so, you know, hopefully, um, you know, we can have a good two weeks from them. And hopefully we can, uh, we'll get Pato back. He's, he's obviously missed out with a broken finger, but, you know, we'll see how he, he um, comes up for the next few days and, and see, if he's, see if he's ready for, for Friday. Um, Cody just followed on from last year. In once more, bowls Ed caught, game over. Adam Lyth takes the catch, and Ben Code has got a six for. And Brooksy's been in great rhythms the first few games, and he's, he's picked up wickets, and he obviously got a five for down at Taunton, which is a, you know, it's a, it's a good effort. Um, so he's bowling, they're both bowling nicely. Um, everyone's pretty much contributing, um, but you know, hopefully we can, you know, put in that uh, a good team performance. What do you think that, that the guys need to do to sort of try and get that consistency going forward? Yeah, I mean, it hasn't been easy. Um, obviously, conditions in April are always tough. Um, you know, coming into the season, you know, not many guys had had um, you know, opportunities to play outside. So we knew it wasn't going to be easy, uh, and it, it probably was going to take a bit of time before before lads found some form and, and rhythm. So you know, now we've spent some time in the middle, uh, played two games. Hopefully, we can um, you know find some consistency now. And, and um, you know, I think the main thing is. You know, if one or two lads get in, they, they do go and get those big scores. That will help us get um, you know over 300 in that first innings, which will you know, give the bowlers a, a chance to win the games for us. Like you said, they were champions from the art last year. Good team, got some good players. Um, you know, when they play in first week, that got got cancelled with the weather. So um, you know, hopefully we can you know, like I say, um, play some good cricket this week and and put in a better performance than we did last year. Uh, pretty much everyone can beat everyone on their day. Um, so we know that we've just got to try and be consistent and, and hopefully we can get two good results in the next few weeks and then um, give us some momentum going into the, into the 50, 50 over stuff.